Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Galactic Civilization 3 Alpha with me, Get Daved. So I just zoomed ahead just a few turns. Um, we've got the ability to invade now. I researched a little bit of uh, this, this improvement of our laboratories and I think I want propulsion here, which is probably under <laughs> this category, I'm assuming. Oh yeah, duh. Fuel mass recapturing. We're going to need to improve our propulsion a little bit. And increase our range because I've sent the snipers out to uh, visit some people. There was a survey ship nearby at one point, which I was hoping to, uh... Oh, I was really hoping for some fireworks, to be honest. It's a little tricky just because... Yay! Well, thanks for the help, Precursor Builders. We also have enough ideology points in the good tree. That's weird. We can choose enlightenment or cultural outreach. Well, this seems creepier. An enlightenment institute. That seems very creepy. More benevolence, culture production. Okay. Interesting. And influence plus 10%. So do I want production or money? Oh, I do like production. We'll go that way. I wonder if I can go sideways at the next level. I'm willing to bet probably not. Cost 47, that's kind of interesting. Cost 96. I wonder if it's influenced by how far we've gone down other paths. Oh well. I'll worry about that later. I think I'm gonna just allow our ships to continue going towards enemy space. I'm sure if we hang around there long enough, we'll find something to shoot. 25% fuel mass recapturing. I think that's good, everybody. <laughs> also see just how terrible the sensors on our little ships are. Whoa, we unlocked all sorts of good stuff. Upgrade things. All right. I like the look of that. Yes. Confirm battle. Can I, can I not kill them yet? Yes, I want to confirm battle. How am I getting hurt? One of them blew up, I think. And this one's badly damaged. I'm not sure how that happened. Did they get support weapons? There could be a military starbase in range that I can't see. little confused as to what happened. Well, you keep trying. Maybe I just was shooting through a stack. Alright everybody, it's a little confusing, <laughs> but 
but I think I think we blew up some ships and then died. Stack changed a few times. Oh, Galcivia. Gonna need to make us some money. Rocking up weight. Well, no. This planet was never really about. It's weird that I built this on. Eh, whatever. This planet was never really about making a ton of money. It was our influence bombing place. But they've got good production. Let's see if we can turn this into a slightly more balanced place. Population improvements. Dur -dur -dur. Okay, and I'm actually going to delete those and make sure we get them on places that benefit the wealth. And the wealthy. Alright, nice little grid of uh, money making. Hopefully that pays dividends. And the two farms should help quite a bit actually. Okay, we might as well just do that for now. Populations on the up and up. Getting us some research. We just have a couple isolated pockets right now. They have decent food. I think we'll go a research lab and then we'll we'll pack it right to the brim and throw in a market center. Because looks like they could have well, it'd be better to build research there. That's fine, they'll do for now. Librius, I believe, is our super production. No, this one's our super production planet. Wonder if we can sort them by their production. Probably not, but Librius, I believe, is pretty good. 7.1, that's one of our highest, and considering its state of development, that's pretty darn good. Colony capital. All right. Build us a starport. It's going to be a shame not to take advantage of these benefits, but that uh, that's working out well enough on its own. A couple factories. Very soon. Librius 1 is a research center, so let's try to develop it along those lines a little bit further. improvements. We get a nice little adjacency bonus there, so that should be good for now. Pardon me there. That'll rack up uh, probably a nasty deficit on the planet's budget, but We'll deal with that when we come to it. And they're taking over my empire. Well, that was inevitable. Hmm. All right, we're going to have to get militant, everybody. Got the transport coming, but... The day we feared has come.
160, that's nothing. Well, no. Yeah, let's rush that. Cross over one turn. Planetary defense is up, that's nice. Oh, growth and research are nice too. All right, let's go that way for now. Idle colony. Population improvement. Do we have anywhere that can get augmented? I got a new thing. Let's build it. Would best... Best go on a, po or a planet with a large population and decent research. I don't know, but now is not the time to focus on that. We've got a planet with decent production. We need to militarize the empire. Uh, pretty good production here, but terrible economic situation right now. Uh, they're going to need at least one market center. And then we'll get going on the starport there as well. And way the heck back at Altaria. wonder if we ever got a chance to figure out what type of weapons the Drangan were using. Guess we'll never know. I feel too threatened to wait. Not researching, okay. Um, I do think we need basic defenses first. Uh, I'm going to gamble that they're using missiles. I don't know, that seems like a reasonable thing. Building sniper, okay. That sounds the same as my ship. That means I need shields. Operating on the assumption that we all have like completely identical uh, vessels, vessels. All right, let's see if we can get in there. Take it over. If we were to launch that, I think we can load it up with people, but we should best have some uh, ships around that can protect it first. Let's take a look at our governance, just make sure we're not racking up too much of a deficit. Stick in the middle for now, I guess. The shift in our economy has, of course, led to a decrease in our production on our actual production worlds. See if I can balance that out a bit better. Oh yeah, we've got we've got the money makers coming. Just have to be a little patient, let the population grow, and then be taken over by our enemies. Patience, Dave. We'll get our chance.
Okay, I'm willing to just start with that right now. Laser specialization. Range sounds nice. Or do we need some sort of money bonus? Wealth plus 10%, you got it. You just keep being more and more good. Okay, we've got a planet leeching all of our beautiful money. Our influence capital, let's throw a market center down. That should help them contribute a little bit. Plus one level to population. So we could maybe get a bonus if we threw down a farm here to increase the cap. Also a bonus to influence. Oh geez, I don't know if I want to go that far. I think I would rather have them just focus on growth after that for a little bit. And Olibrius 3, I guess we cultured it into our own empire again? Wealth and research. Influence. Where's my production bonus? Okay. Guess we'll try clustering a few of those together then. And they don't have a prayer unless we buy some of it, but that's okay. Would not mind getting that colony just at some point, because then we could almost have Wealth of Dragon really just closed off, but I need the means to hurt them first. Six point oh. Okay, they're rebounding a little bit. And the economy is rebounding a little bit. We're already at plus two. Boy, the 10k you start the game with uh, evaporates quickly. With reckless and irresponsible spending. To thine own self be true. Population 6.7. That could increase a fair bit. Colonial Bank. So I believe that's an upgrade for... the market centers we have right now. Hmm. Well, let's get better guns. Priorities, people. We may have been able to culture our way out of our immediate problems, although not over here. And Wisp is actually getting pretty good. I don't know how, but they uh, loaded it up with people and are doing pretty well for themselves. But I know just what the cure will be. Of course, there isn't really a way we can take that over, I don't think. Yeah.
Good work, everybody. We took it over. <laughs> Uh, it looks to be in great shape. Um, everything good about it was preserved. <laughs> Whoops. Well, uh, plus one to everything, huh? I guess just research for now. It looks like they can absorb a little bit of expense, so that's nice. Thrace has the makings of a balanced colony. They're not researching anything right now. Oh, let's throw in a research lab or two. When the population gets up there, well, maybe they'll be able to break even. Who knows? Why not? What the heck happened? Maybe the invasion cost money? That's often a thing. Well, I don't like the deficit spending one bit. Or at least having a deficit. So we can just completely screw up our economy to try... No, we'll, we'll try to stay balanced. We don't have diplomacy in the game yet, so normally in this situation I would try pawning off some goods to try balancing the budget. Altaria. Hmm. Means our second sniper is done. Yeah, now we're talking. Did I get enough hiss into the mic? Second sniper. The Mark II looks much better. And the cutter. Oh, whoa, whoa. Cutter's got way more hit points as... All right, we'll do one of each. It's probably a larger ship class or something. Although, yeah, yeah, it looks a bit bigger, maybe. Hard to get a full sense of scale in there. All right. We'll wait for them to produce those ships and then send them to the star base. Yeah. Way the heck over here. Cancel the sniper. There will be no manufacturing of anything less than a sniper too. But more importantly, we have some needs here. This actually would be a really good place for like an economic star base or something. Even we might be able to get it like here or so and get Thrace in it and benefit five planets all at once. But that doesn't have a ton to do with killing the enemy, and, well, that just won't do. Okay, let's get interstellar banking. We need to resolve this deficit crisis. Ideology. Money? Not in the alpha. Okay. Well, tourism income sounds good. Delcivia. Jewel of the Empire. Also, it's bringing in a fair bit of money right now, which is to be expected from the, the money grid we've set up. Make it rain. 
I mean, it gets like plus three just from adjacency and spreads three adjacency bonuses as well. That's pretty cool. If you had a nice, like, full seven cell hex pattern, you could do some crazy stuff. Uh, the population... I guess it'd be kind of cool if we could get that a little bit higher, too. What else can we do? Plus two to wealth, plus two to tourism. Yeah, you know what? Let's try putting this mediation center right there. Wealth plus 20%, sure. Throw that into the mix. And there's a pretty big empire out there. We're just gonna have to take it over, I think. Kind of sad that I can't build a ship and name it the Legendary Sword. Doesn't seem right. Okay. Budget recovered. Our aggressive measures have allowed us to get out of debt and greatly refocus our uh, economy now. Back to the weapons, everybody. To do, current date. It's always funny the little things that slip people's attention when they're doing a, a rush to build, but that said, this is still a very solidly built alpha. Hmm. Wealth, tourism, and population. Well, I feel like we can throw one of these down here. And you know, at this point, I barely care what they do here. I guess some research labs. Go nuts, except there. That's just wait. Well, no, adjacency bonuses are nice. We're gonna do it. And they don't have a single market center. They just have a ton of research centers. Uh, we'll throw one of these down. I believe this is actually supposed to be my research capital. That was a Librius one. Yeah, this is the research capital, okay. Okay, we'll throw this in there. They'll like never finish it, but it's nice to think about. Throw a factory into the mix. It'll probably lead to more speed in the end. How are you guys doing? Population still capping, that's fine. We'll switch them to a research project though. No, don't go out of range. Ah, dang it. Had an opportunity to shoot him down and I didn't take it. Okay, down here, the constructor's taking forever. 
but they're a pretty big deal. Alright. Thrace 1 is ready to go. Uh, I think we will try getting them manufacturing some weapons too. I mean, 8.1 is pretty good. Get a good mix churned out. Hopefully with our invention of shields we'll be able to do some damage to uh, the enemy. And I think I'm going to go meet him right now, actually. The longer we wait, the more obsolete these ships will become, and, well, let's just try shooting some people down right away, shall we? That's how I like to operate. Hmm. Hit points increase. No, I want the guns. These are all coming pretty quickly, but let's go with particle beams. They sound uh, destructive. Wisp is uh, free now, so uh, they're only good at research, so go get them, Tiger. Alright, cool. They formed a larger fleet, so that's nice. Looks like this interface isn't quite done yet. We'll just leave that alone. Those guys uh, have used up all their moves, so we'll just have to wait. You can pass. Alright, in you go. Kill everything. Don't stop killing. Okay, so what I think was happening before was they had a huge number of constructors stacked, and there was a ship with guns in there that I wasn't uh, noticing. Whoa, Sniper Mark III? Seems terrible. Go get him. Took some damage but killed everything, I guess? One ship defending. I don't know. Kill. I think we just had great success. Shields are amazing. <laughs> Alright, I guess uh, now that the economy's rebounded, we could invest in some armed sh or some transports again. Altaria's population, well, it's rebounded a bit. We'll do one here and. Galcivia's got lots of people. Oh no, no. They'll be perfect, actually. And they don't even know what to do with themselves. They have no, uh... <laughs> they have no starport, though. I guess we'll start there. Yeah, we'll just keep going on that, then. I 
I hope. Oh, there we go. Get him. All right, some ships with weapons. Wow. And they destroyed my fleet. Yeah, and maybe I missed some sort of stacked ship or something, because they appeared to have a lot less firepower than I had. We'll have a cutter in three turns, and then we'll see who's laughing. Alright, uh, back and forth struggle goes. I think we're good for now. Maybe I'll run one more turn. Two more turns. And research. Let's clean that out. Ah, good. Galcivia. I require some things. Mm. Do the escort first. Alright, I just want to get Cutter out and take some action here. Just because uh, it's such an exciting ship. It's got hit points and stuff. Alright, we'll call it... The wow! And propulsion. It's much more useful. Anyway, thanks for watching everybody. In the next one, uh, I don't know, maybe we'll explore the military a little bit more and see how things are going. I'll see you there.